Welcome to the Silhouette Curio Overview video. This video will familiarize you with your new electronic tool. The Silhouette Curio cuts and sketches on an 8.5 inch by 6 inch work area and offers additional versatility by providing functions unique to the Curio such as etching, embossing, and stippling. The Curio also features a dual carriage that lets you use up to two tools at once, making possible multicolor sketching and other advanced processes such as scoring and embossing. Your Curio comes with the following items in the box. Curio electronic tool, USB cable, power adapter, Silhouette Studio software, Curio user manual, cutting blade, fine embossing tool, wide embossing tool, standard 8.5 by 6 inch base, three spacing platforms, embossing mat, cutting mat, a free trial subscription card to the Silhouette Design Store where you can choose from thousands of designs. You may purchase additional accessories for the Curio that are not included in the box. An 8.5 inch wide by 12 inch long base for larger projects, larger cutting and embossing mats of the same size, stippling and etching tool, sketch pens, various metallic sheets for stippling and etching, specialized score and embossed paper. Let's start working with your new Curio. Begin by removing it from its box, then remove all packing tape. When placing your Curio on your work surface, ensure there is adequate space behind and in front of it. If you purchase the larger base, be sure to reach underneath the Curio and fully extend its front and back stabilizer feet to help prevent the Curio from tipping over. Plug your Curio into a wall outlet using the included power adapter and cable. Next, connect your Curio to your computer using a USB cable. You will find the four storage slots, two on either side of the Curio's interior where you can store multiple tools. When using your Curio to cut or score, you can adjust the blade depth to match your material. Insert the blade into the adjustment socket on the base's front left side. Align the arrow on the blade with the mark on the base. Then simply twist the blade until the blade depth number you want is lined up with the mark on the base. Depending on your project type, you will need to add or remove spacing platforms from the base. You can then place your chosen mat on top of the platforms. Small plastic snaps hold your chosen mat in place. Once your mat is in place, you are ready to load the base into the Curio. If your Curio is powered off when you insert the base, simply push the base into the Curio so that the notch on the base is pushed beyond the front edge of the Curio. Press the power button on the Curio side. The Curio will automatically move the base and carriage to their proper positions. If your Curio is already powered on when you go to load your base, you must first press the load unload button on the Curio's side to unlock the rollers and allow you to insert the base. Once the notch on the base is pushed beyond the front edge of the Curio, press the load unload button again and the Curio will automatically move the base and carriage to their proper positions. Once your Curio is powered on and connected to your computer, open your Silhouette Studio software. Silhouette Studio will automatically detect the powered on Curio and unlock advanced software settings related to etching, stippling, and embossing. You can import or create designs in your Silhouette Studio software. Once your design is finalized, you can send the job to your Curio by clicking on the Cut Settings icon, then at the bottom of the screen click Send to Silhouette. If you need to pause the Curio during a job, Simply press the pause button on the Curio side. A yellow light near the pause button will illuminate to indicate that the current job is paused. You may then press the load unload button on the Curio side to unlock the rollers and allow you to remove the base, inspect your project, make any adjustments you wish, then reinsert the base. Press the load unload button and the Curio will automatically return the carriage to the position it was in when you paused the job. Finally, press the pause button again to resume the job. To cancel a pause job, press and hold down the pause button for 5 seconds. 
See the other videos in our Curio series to learn more about your Silhouette Curio.